morning YouTube. Welcome to another installment on the channel. Today is going to be mainly a cardio day. I'm going to be doing some different cardio uh, exercises today. And the main one I wanted to show you guys, you kind of seen a clip of it in another one of my videos, but one of my favorite machines is this row machine here. Like I say, in your local gym, you may have seen one before, but this row machine is a cardio machine because you have the one with weights that's used for weightlifting. But this one here is a cardio machine. So I'm going to be showing you guys this one here and how it works in case you've never seen it before. I'm about to show you guys on this row machine that I was talking about, about how your stroke should look. And if you're getting a really good stroke in, you're going to burn a lot of calories on this machine because you're going to be using your legs, abs, and your arms. That's what you want to do. You want to do the machines that you're going to burn a lot of calories on. And yeah, you're putting in a lot of work, but you're getting the work in on one machine instead of having to go from machine to machine to machine, which I'm kind of going to do today anyway. Is the Stairmaster. I'm pretty sure we've all heard about the Stairmaster. Now, I have a cousin that swears by this Stairmaster. He claims like he'll get in here for like an hour and a half and he'll lose like five pounds on this one machine. I definitely can't rule that out. I mean, I've seen him sweat on this thing. I mean, he literally be dripping sweat and he doesn't even use the um, sweatsuits. So that's another thing. If you're working hard on this, on the Stairmaster, you shouldn't need to use a sweatsuit. If you need to use a sweatsuit, you're just not putting in enough effort. You need to take that sweatsuit off and go harder on this machine. Now, I'm not saying don't use a sweatsuit, but I'm saying on this machine in particular, you shouldn't need one. Out here at this gym they have two different types of ab, ex ab exercises like you have this one here which you sit on it and with those straps you put them across your chest from the back and then you lean forward that's how you do that machine now this one here you sit on it you keep your arm straight forward and you sit all the way forward so they kind of sort of look similar but because of their different setup, they feel different when you do them and they work your ab muscles in a different way. So 
I did this one last time. I'm gonna be showing you guys this one here. This wouldn't be complete if I didn't show you guys this machine here, the art trainer. Now this gym do have two different types of art trainers. Like as you can see, these have the uh, heart rate sensors on the monitor part, not on the, not here. And then these over here are a little bit different to where the heart rate sensors are on the handles that you can actually hold. So these over here are a little bit different. I doubt that it works your body differently, but I'm gonna do just one of them today. my outro in the gym just because I wanted to be a little bit quiet to talk to you guys for a minute so that was a cardio and abs day and you don't have to necessarily do every exercise that I did because on each one of those machines if you work out really hard on each one of those machines that one may be all you need to do and two you don't have to do the hour and a half and two hours of cardio it just doesn't take that long so you can do just 20 or 30 minutes of high intensity interval training style on either one of those machines and that'll be adequate so you guys stay tuned there'll be more videos to come i'm going to be doing some informational videos that it won't be any working out but it'll be me giving you guys some information and that's also just as important so you guys stay tuned like and subscribe to videos like i said we're going to be doing a lot this summer you guys stay tuned catch you guys later